We're going to work on the world's greatest stretch. So what we have to think about is that if we're having stiffness in our lower back, if we're having problems and pain in our lower back, we've got to make sure that our hip flexors aren't too tight, pulling us into a pelvic tilt forward and that our glutes are firing. And then we want to work on hip mobility. So this stretch gets all of those things all at once. So it looks a lot like a runner stretch. So go ahead and get up in it, Jeff. So he's coming forward, he's inside of this left knee right here, and then his back leg is straight, and he's firing this glute right here, really tight. You can tell that he doesn't have any extension in his lower back. He is not gonna drop. Show, go ahead and show us a bad one. That's a bad position. Now you feel more of a stretch right here, but that's gonna be a problem long term. So we wanna get back up, we wanna stay in neutral right here, because he's firing this glute, he's actually gonna relax those hip flexors. It's a very effective way to do it without causing problems. Now let's go ahead and come up out of it. He puts his hand on that leg and then he comes back. Now come back the other way. He puts his hand on his leg and then he stays in neutral as he comes up. So same thing, right arm is in, inside of the knee put on the foot and he's pushing his knee out to the side. So he's getting a stretch all through this area of the hip. And then his back leg, he's firing that glute really hard. We should be able to get a really good glute contraction on this side. That'll relax the hip flexors. He's holding it for 10 seconds, squeezing really hard. And then he's gonna put his right hand up on this knee and he's gonna stay in neutral as he comes up using that right glute to come up. Now you try it.